everybody, Elizabeth here, coming at you with another Maker Monday. We're going to do a little bit of upcycling today with our sleeve left over from maybe your older sisters, your mom's no-sew t-shirt bag from earlier this month. We're going to make another little bag for our American Girl doll or for any other doll stuffed animal that needs its own bag. So, first off, we have this pretty sleeve with this nice, pretty little fringe line. What we're going to do is we're going to start at the shortest end, and we're going to just make some cuts. And what we want to do is then make all of our cuts all the way up to that original cut line. Or you could make it kind of lower, and then you'd have kind of a bag that has this really cool personalized line. And I think I will try that out today. So make sure you get a good pair of scissors because you know fabric can be a little hard to cut sometimes. And I'm just making these about three quarters of an inch wide. And you can make them however big you want to at home. So the difficult part is going to be getting those end piece fringes, especially this big long one. I'm actually going to flip mine over here because I cut with my right hand. It's easier for me to go like this and just kind of hold it down like so. So now we're just going to make a bunch of simple knots. We're just going to make a square knot where you tie the first part of your bow like to tie your shoes and then you tie it again and you make a square knot. And see that really cool fringe I've got? And then we're just going to do that with our second set. And it's okay that it moves around. It's going to. So just the beginning of how to tie your shoes twice. So you have a one right hand and a left hand, one over the other, pull it tight, then put one over the other again, and pull it tight. And it's okay if you have to take your other fringe and kind of get it out of the way. That's what happens with fringe sometimes. Remember, your short ones are going to be a little bit harder to tie because you don't have all that extra long stuff to hold on to. But don't get frustrated. You guys can do it. And so you might have to maybe roll it up or kind of half it a little bit or maybe even get some parent help for this last knot. So, now that we have our really cool fringe, I'm going to cut two slits in my bag. And I'm going to try to make sure that I go through all my layers here. And it looks like I did. Then I'm going to take my piece of ribbon and I'm going to thread it through. piece of ribbon. It doesn't have to be this thick. This is just kind of what I found at the library. And then you can make a handle by putting it on the same side. And then flip it over and do the same thing. And voila, we have a cute little bag for our American Girl. We hope you guys had a good time and have fun making this craft maybe later on this week. We'll hopefully see you at the library and we'll talk to you later, guys.